Okay, so here's Joseph, and he has his opportunity, and he's before Pharaoh, the king of Egypt, the main man, the most powerful man in the world at this time, who says, I need your help. And Joseph turns to him, the most powerful man at this time, and says, I can't do it. Sorry, I can't do it. It's just something that I cannot do. But then he turns it because Joseph realizes that even though he can't do it, there is someone who can, and that is God. See, in the moments that we have when we struggle the most, we are willing to turn to God. But there are other moments where we know that we can shine, and many times we tend to take the credit for those moments and say, this is something that I can do. I can handle this. And because of that, we're forgetting God. What are some areas in your life where you realize that, you know what, I'm really not giving God the credit, and these are times where I can count my blessings or realize there are so many things that He has given me and so many things that He has blessed me with. Why do I not recognize Him at those times? The Bible says that we should pray without ceasing. It shares that with us. And what that means is recognizing God in the good times and in the bad times. Counting the blessings, understanding there's going to be curses, but at all times to recognize Him. And here's Joseph, and he did just that. He said, I can't do it, but God can. Where in your life do you realize there are things that you're not doing or can't do, but that God can, and God is willing to do so? Rest in that for a little while, and we'll talk more tomorrow.